What's up guys and welcome back Last of Us 2 I won't go, about, go on about uh, the previous episode in my live stream uh, We all know what happened And if you don't know what happened I suggest you go watch it <laughs> uh, So yeah, I guess uh, we're, um, we're now on our way to uh, Seattle to uh, hunt down the uh, Washington Liberation Front. Gotta say, the game is absolutely gorgeous. Like graphics-wise, it's brilliant. Going through the forest. Ah, finally, I can actually gallop. Uh, so yeah, I hope you guys are doing well. I uh, hope you're enjoying the uh, the content. Um, so far, I'm enjoying the game. I know there are mixed reviews about it. Cars. Cars. Dang. I know. Um, it's been 25 years, but. All this grass has grown over, huh? all this greenery has grown over. It's just like uh, Dr. Jeff Goldblum said, uh, nature finds a way. Guess I was wrong. Turns out you do know where you're going. <laughs> um, yeah, I know, like, obviously I've, I've, I've mentioned this before, but, you know, I've heard mixed reviews about it, but so far I'm enjoying it. Um, I can understand at this point why people are a little bit annoyed <laughs> I've got to admit that I am also one of those people but uh, you know and like I say I'm not going to give anything away just go watch the previous episode you'll find out why And yes, if you're wondering, I am rocking yes. the mohawk. <laughs> I like that we're uh, picking up these like trading cards rather than uh, the comic books on the previous game. I'm assuming they're um, they're based on the comic books. Oh, nice map of Seattle. That should come in handy, I would think. Nothing on there, it's nothing special on there, but you know. Anything good in there? Found an old tourist map. Well, that's something. <laughs> I don't know if like uh, the grass and stuff would grow like this um, to to this level. I mean, um, sure seems quiet. Yeah, think about how. I mean, I've seen videos of uh, what's it called, Chernobyl or whatever, it, or whatever it's called. Um, that was like a town that's been abandoned for however many years, thirty odd years, I think. Um, and I don't know if the greenery is grown there like it has here in this, but what do I know? I'm not a botanist, so you know. Whoa, is that the QZ? Yep. <laughs> Watch the high spots. What's left of it? WLF. Trespassers killed on sight. You think they would uh, 
for a um, an organised group, they would have had a better tag. <laughs> I'm so nervous that there's there's going to be infected around, especially after seeing it, uh, the level of how many infected there are. Cracks in the wall. Who built this wall? Like, if the infect infection outbreak day was supposed to be like this big, massive event, would you really have time to build massive walls like that? Are we in Mexico? <laughs> okay, what's there? Like prison, prison cells, what looks like. Cells. Soldiers have them in Boston too. There we go. Okay, now what? I guess we're going up here. Dina, help me up here. Okay. Good, good upper body strength, Ellie. Like it. Sounds good. Let me just adjust this camera slightly. No, wrong way. There we go. Okay, if I fall now, that's it, I'm done for. Oh, that makes me nervous. I've got a balance. Oh my god. Okay, we're all good. We're good. We're good. Uh, I guess we're jumping across to there. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, long way down. Okay, we're good. We're good. Now, what do I do? Can I crawl? No. Oh, I wonder, ah, I wonder. Yeah, I bet you've got to crawl through here. Oh, man. I'm so nervous about falling. Oh, I don't need to crawl, I can just crouch, that's alright. Right, now this is a pretty long jump, by the looks of it. If I miss this... Yeah, oh, fuck indeed. Just almost died. Alright, now where to? Didn't seem to be anywhere to go. Alright, I could shoot me across that ledge, but where to? Um. Hmm. Do anything in the generator thing? No? Okay. Ah. Who would have known it was that simple, eh? These fuckers. Yeah, where are these fuckers indeed? Considering they're supposed to be this massive organised group, you would have thought uh, they would have had this gate fairly cut, well covered. Which says to me, the uh, shit is well and truly hit the fan. Okay. Don't want to get in here. Oh, it's locked. 
Oh, in I go then. <laughs> I suppose I could have used, found a brick or something really, a bottle or something, rather than waste a bullet. Ooh, codes. Yeah. Hopefully they're still in date. Got a big operation coming out by that wants us to scavenge any remaining supplies from downtown. Okay. Feel free to pause the uh, the game if you want to read the uh, notes and stuff, guys. Usually I would read them outright, but I've heard the games long enough as it is. You don't want to be uh, spending ten minutes me reading notes. Oh, there's a brick I needed. Oh well, doesn't hurt to keep on to it just in case. All right. That doesn't work. Hmm. There must be a generator or something nearby, surely. On the plus side, it's a nice sunny day, you know. Apparently, it, uh, it rains nine months of the year in Seattle, so. <laughs> Unless you're in a post apocalyptic uh, event type thing. Okay, we can open that. Uh, and then we'll carry this. Maybe I should have plugged it in before. Oh, yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> Maybe I should have plugged it in before I turned on the generator. Oh yeah. Uh, does anybody find Dina annoying? Or is it just me? We believe in you, what? You and the horse? Seriously though, I do find her really annoying. I don't know what it is. Uh, maybe I'm just being harsh. Well, the main gate ain't working. News. Oh, hello. Missed you. I've probably missed so much already, like stuff that I can pick up. I know I missed the, uh, I missed a safe in the first episode. I can't spend my entire uh, game just trying to find keys and safes and stuff like that, you know. I've got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, we're not getting across there, so I'm guessing I'm just going to have to pull the cable out and then throw it over. Yep. Whee! Most of stuff like this, they've definitely put a lot of thought into the game, like the fact that you can just bust open windows to get in and you can throw cables and ropes over to access certain areas, it's kind of cool. Alright, hopefully that's powered the gate. I just 
just want to check over here, just in case. No, there's nothing over here. Alright. See what I mean? Don't want to waste my time just exploring constantly all the time. But. Passcode? Uh. I don't know. <laughs> Let's just try something. No. Oh, wait. We got that note, didn't we, with all the passcodes on it? Let's have a look. Is it my journal? No. No check check what gate codes, that's what I want. Main gate, 0512. See, I'm not completely stupid. <laughs> okay, so zero five one two. Yes. We're in. Well done. I mean, it almost killed you as well, but. Yeah, I was gonna say that's gonna attract a few uh, people. All infected. All right, let's get out of here. Ravina Hotel. Ah. That's that simple, that easy. It's five three four five then. So we need to get power to the gate first. So I'm assuming uh we'll follow the cables, yeah. I'm assuming with the um with the addition of the horse and stuff like that, it does feel more very much more open world than the uh the previous game. Um I know we had a brief moment with the horse, with a horse in Last of Us 1, but this definitely feels much more um, open world, I would say. Which is interesting. Tommy did come through here, you would have thought there'd be some sign of him, I would have guessed. Ah, oh, it's a good job we picked up this map, innit? Can you imagine what would have happened if we hadn't? Okay. See what I mean about it being open world? So now we've got a map. Um, so it definitely feels very much more open world. Distribution center. In Boston, we'd line up the blocks. 
My food sucked. I go crazy. At least some people did. Yeah, I thought it just it looks like an important military building, so with military buildings you usually got ammo and stuff. Okay. Oh I see, so you'll have little question marks and then you go explore it and then loot it of all of its resources and then you mark it off your map. Can I upgrade anything? doesn't look like it, but I'll have a look anyway. I must admit I do like this uh, presentation they give you for the workbench, you know, obviously in the, in the previous one it was just, you know, you hear him like, <laughs> tape something, like, tape something to the gun and that was it, but I do like this, the whole like, disassembling of the gun, looking at the gun, what can I upgrade, right. And you have to reload the bullets again, which is super realism. But it makes perfect sense. Okay, so I've marked it to say that there's a workbench here. Okay. This guy's been dead a long time. I heard in a room at the West Bank, bank was no husband in search, and it's true. Come on, I don't have the balls to go in there by myself. Uh, okay. So, let's go check out the bank. As far as Dean has not asked what it is. What is it? Okay, so where's the bank? Down there, okay. I guess uh, I'll be checking my map quite a lot. <laughs> Ooh. Hmm. Oh, there is a note here. Oh, cool drawing. I guess I know I should maybe read the journal, but if you guys want me to read the journal, feel free to um, put a comment in the box down below, and uh, yeah, I'll definitely I'll start going through it if you really want to read it. If you're not that bothered, then you know, don't worry about it. <laughs> I can't get on. Okay, we'll go on this side then. Alright, so we're facing that way, so if we just turn around, it's a straight up shot. Okay, well we'll go back and check that out in a minute. Let's uh Yeah, it's got a circle over it so it must be uh important. Well check out the tank. You were saying something? Yeah, so I can't see you taking orders from anybody. Yeah. Good point. I gotta say I was expecting the Seattle QZ to be a lot more occupied. Yeah. Yeah. Good point. Looks recent. Think it was Tommy? Maybe. 
Right, so the bank is around here, right? I'm sure it's uh, somewhere around here. Ah, okay, I'm facing the wrong way. Maybe it's towards the tank. Oh, well, we ain't going that way. Uh, oh, what's in here? Ah. It'd be interesting, like, in another 25 years from this, like, if they do a Last of Us 3 and it's, you know, 20 years later or something, Ellie's all grown up, she's an adult now, uh, in her mid-30s, early 40s, and, uh, like, a kid now will find stuff from the, what's considered the old world and be like, Hey, what's this? Uh, it's some filing. Oh, there we go. Yep, let's go in. Clickers, we all know how I don't handle clickers very well. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can. Uh... Ooh, can they hear me with my bag? No? Okay. Can I craft a Molotov? Yes, one. Hopefully one is all I'll need. I guess uh, being 24 years in the future from, from Outbreak Day, we're going to see more and more clickers. That. I survived! Okay. Yay! That's all of them. <gasps> oh, I'm so happy! I actually good. managed it! Maybe they worked at the bank. Sure. Is it? I don't know if it's me, but. Uh, the Molotovs don't seem to be quite as effective against clickers as they used to be. You know, in Last of Us 1 you could just uh, throw a Molotov and, you know, they would burn up uh, fairly quickly. But this time, you know, I, I threw that Molotov at that clicker and he still had time to come at me. Um, and it obviously only took one bullet to kill him, but still. Ooh. Vault code. 
602306. Which one? The one with the surfer bank robbers. Um, Point break. Yeah. Love that movie. Great movie, to be fair. Uh, was it 06 or 60? Zero? 60. Zero. Confused me because there's 06 at the end. Right, okay. Let's go. Six zero, yeah. Two three zero six. Oh yeah. We, we go robbing banks. Ooh. Shotgun. My favorite weapon. Just because against clickers it's great. You just boom. There is a the the downside is you have to get close, but you know. But the answer was just being in here at the end. Again, guys, if you want to read it, feel free to pause the game and uh, go for it. Can't fault their logic. Everything's chaotic. Now's the time. But it's outbreak day. Look at all this cash. It's a shame it probably means nothing to you people anymore. <laughs> but Ellie, if uh, civilization does eventually uh, repair itself, just remember. There's a bank here full of cash <laughs> that you can use. No one will ever know. Let's face it, that probably won't happen. I don't know how the uh, civilization is working now. I mean, obviously, uh, Fedra made everybody use ration cards in the first one, but it would seem that Fedra is no longer around anymore and that people are just building communities by themselves um, so what would you use as currency? I suppose you'd just use a, a bartering system bullets bullets are probably a big uh, bullets and weapons are probably a big bartering tool like if you want something really important what? there's more of them in there? I thought I cleaned it out Got only got one shell in the shotgun. Great. I can deal with this one. It's the it's the clicker I'm worried about. Alright. One down. One to go. I'll equip the shotgun just in case I need to. Oh man, that's so creepy. Why am I looking at my map? I'm trying to craft Molotov. There we go. See? See what I mean? Don't burn up like they used to, for sure. All right, let's get to the um, to the Superdome. So 
head towards that. Funny how they call it the old world now. You can get a farmhouse now. Okay. What would you get? A space shuttle. No, oh, that's right. Your astronaut thing. Hey, it's cooler than a farmhouse. Farmhouse is way more practical. Yeah, yeah man. This was crazy. Got a shotgun out of it. So Alright, let's find that gas. Yeah man, shotgun's important. Uh, you know Ellie, you don't just have to settle for, for Dina. You know, there'll be other women. Because <laughs> I find her really annoying. Never before have I. No, do I go this way? No, let's go this way. Boston always had food shortages. Hungry people get desperate. Yeah, that's true. I suppose we've not found like a farm or somewhere to where you grow food. Right, in we go. Great. Staying crouched until grass makes it more difficult for enemies to see you. Okay, so very Ghost of the Shell. Uh, Ghost of Tsushima, Ghost of the Shell. I'm losing my mind. Ghost of Tsushima. <sighs> Do say some silly things. Uh oh, I think you see me. Alright, one down. Ow! 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 Ooh. Sliced up her throat real good. I think we dropped all of them. Yeah, looks that way. Uh, it doesn't look like I can craft any med packs either, so. Prone to hide in short grass. Okay. Guess we're hiding in the short grass. Ooh. Oh, those clickers sleeping. It's interesting that they don't move, they're just standing there. Oh, they are moving, they're twitching. Don't come any closer, please don't go on it. Right, okay. Okay, I guess this is that thing where uh, you don't always have to kill them. Like, you don't have to kill every single infected you find. You can just go pa sneak past them if you want to. But worried this guy's gonna see me. Yeah, the uh, it's called the um, because clickers are usually like everywhere, aren't they? But they're just standing there, chilling. Getting in them rays. Alright, 
right, we're in. We can ignore these guys. If we have to come back later, then maybe we uh, we can take them out when we've got a bit more ammo or whatever. In we go. Take it she's Jewish then. This place brings back a lot of memories. My sister used to drag me to a synagogue all the time. You never struck me as much of a believer. Nah. But I like coming from a long line of survivors. You mean after Outbreaker? That. And the Inquisition. And the, and the Holocaust. Yeah. <laughs> Bullets. Oh, I'm push this. Oh, I guess we can go up and over. All right, okay. Let's open the door first. No. Nah, let's go up and over. Empty! Oh, great. And there's no gas. She's doing it for us. Okay, fine. Let's open this door, see if there's something on this side. place. Oh wait, hang on. I bet you've got to get up there. There's a scaffold there. Maybe if we push this thing over to that scaffold, we can climb up. Right, impeccable driving skills as always. Right, up, up and over, up and over. Nice. Fresh and tears an active door of high on spring. Yeah. Okay. Somewhere to check out on Z map. Okay, it's down there. Right. Parts! We like parts!
What's this? Oh, this is the Torah. The what? Oh, it's, it's a scripture. It's like a, like a Jewish Bible. Hmm. My sister would have looked for this. <laughs> the one we used in New Mexico is half burnt. All right. Well, at least I didn't just chuck everything. Well guys, I think I'm going to leave the episode there. I know it's not been very exciting. Uh, we're still in the early stages, but I hope you've enjoyed the episode. Remember to like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care.